people. I'm the dude, and this is more Cortex Command. Uh, exact same level. Uh, just like I said in the last episode, I'm going to be dropping another Mia in because I need another digger on the right side. Those guys are not falling into a hole at the moment, and they should be. Let's see, is there anyone over there? No, there's not. Good. Is there a digger over there? No, there's not. Not good. Okay. Gotta get her a digger. Either an enemy took it, or it was destroyed by an attack, or something. Why am I on guns? Tools. Digger. Do it. No, no. No. No, no. Don't kill her. No. 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 Leave my Mia alone. No. No. Okay, there's my digger bouncing through the air over there. Let's see, there's... Whoa! Okay, don't do that. As you can see, my Mia is bleeding from the knee and the head. She's not doing so well. <laughs> Whoa, there's a lot of guys over here. Okay, let's try some napalm. See if they like napalm. Actually, the cluster mine might be better, since this is out in the open right here. We want it as far over there as we can get. So, right there. Mia, get away from the edge. They will kill you. I don't want you to die. Cluster mine. Boom. There it is, flying through the air, and... It didn't blow anyone up. Okay, I don't know if that was a glitch or something. It's supposed to shoot mines out everywhere. Huh. Okay, we'll try napalm. You cannot fail with napalm. I have never seen napalm fail. I don't even think it can fail. I don't think it's in the realm of possibility for napalm to fail. A couple of them made it past, sadly. But, oh well. Napalm! Boom. <laughs> I blew off his legs. Oops. I blew off his leg. No, I didn't. His legs. I blew off his legs. And these four are melting. <laughs> more napalm. Must have more napalm. Just to make sure the job gets done. It should actually kill these two in the center. Right here. Come on. Boom! <laughs> yes! Killed like three of them. Two of them instantaneously. Two other ones almost instantaneously. And this one got away with his life. The little bastard. But he's stuck on my, my garters right here. My rail garter things. Come on, get going. I want to get my digger. Oh, he doesn't have a gun. He's harmless. The gun got knocked out of his hand. Let's see. We want the digger right here. Yes. And we want to dig. Same deal as over there. Want to make the, the hole fairly big because we want them to fall into it. It's at this start point. And then we'll make it smaller so they can't get farther in. And it's probably big enough. Straight down to right about there is probably good. Oh crap. Okay, get going, Mia. Get, get going. Go. He has a gun. Crawl. No, go. Flee. Don't. No. No. Get, no, off of me. Off. Oh. <laughs> He has one of the uh, the uber weapons, so if you get hit by it, you're just dead, basically. I think that's the Annihilator, actually. So basically, I have to kill off these guys, build another Mia, and keep digging this tunnel. Or at least that's the goal for the moment. Uh, my MG turrets are annihilating these guys. I'll go ahead and help them out. There was debris in the way, so my MG turret was kind of stuck. He couldn't shoot anyone. Took his... Looks like I took his foot off. I shot his digger out of his hand. And he's dead. His robot right here is still alive, though. So, yeah, let's finish him off. He's missing a leg. He's missing a leg and an arm. And now he's missing an everything. <laughs> he has nothing, though. He's just toast. Uh, buy menu. Let's get another napalm on these guys. As you can see, the holes are really effective. They are extremely effective. In fact, I'm probably going to catch all five of these guys and kill them all. If he stays right there, the crate will hit him in the head and kill him instantly. Not even. Boom! <laughs> if 
five for one deal. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Bye bye. He's probably gonna fall in the fire. Nope, he caught himself before he hit the fire. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's make another Mia so we can continue digging. I don't. I think I just blew up our digger, so we're gonna have to get another one. Let's see. Mia and Nutcrafts tools, medium digger. Yeah, just drop her straight in the hole. Is there anyone over here? No, there's not. Oh, there is. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to hurry before they get here. Gonna have to hurry. Don't shoot my Mia, you asshole. Don't be a douche. Okay, get off the ceiling. There we go. There we go. And we want to go all the way over here. Keep going. All the way to the edge. And then straight down. Oh, there's a... There's a walker stuck in my hole over there. Interesting. I'll get someone to kill him in a second. Probably with a thumper. And we want to go down. There we go. He might actually make it down, which isn't good. Usually the, the humanoid units, they get stuck in these, these tunnels. But apparently the walkers can actually make it pretty far. Yeah, he might actually make it down. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, crap. Huh. Okay, let's switch over to her. And get to digging, because he's going to get us. He's going to get us if we do not dig. There we go. Dig, dig, dig. Come on. Go, go, go. Okay, I should be fairly safe for now. But I need to get someone down there to kill him. Because my Mia does not have a gun. Sadly. Yeah, I doubt he can make it through that. Or at least not easily. So, she should be safe. How's this Mia doing? She's fine. She's fine. Ooh, I need another napalm. Let's see. Bombs, napalm. The standard bomb is a piece of crap. Don't ever use it. It doesn't actually get kills. It's just kind of garbage. I mean, it does very little damage. It'll do like half their health if it hits them directly. Whereas the napalm is just instant death for anyone that goes anywhere near it. You're gonna shoot the crate with the bomb in it? <laughs> he just blew himself up. <laughs> he blew himself up and then blew up my bomb. And this bomb just instantly killed those three. <laughs> he blew his own leg off. <laughs> Sorry, he blew his leg off and his arm off. He's got one leg and one arm. <laughs> That's what you get, fool. And then there's a dismembered head just sitting here on top of this pile of guts. <laughs> Let's see. I need to get someone down there, but there's too much crap in the way. Hmm. Hmm. Don't go over after her. Stay over there. No? Yeah, stay over there. Okay, I'm gonna make me a little Rambo guy to get down there and kill him. Or at least that's the plan. Let's see. I need someone tough. He's gonna be expensive, but I need them to be tough. And I need something that can take out the... The walker. The... The... the uh, the turret. It's gonna have to be some explosive. Hmm. We'll use the thumper. I like the thumper. And I might need a digger just to get down there. So we'll get him a medium digger. Land up here. That'll work. <laughs> this guy's stuck in the wall over here. <laughs> See if I can shoot them from here. No, not really. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no. 
Nope. He's flying around like a jackass. There we go. Headshot. Another headshot. Dead. That guy's still stuck in the ceiling like a jackass. Okay, let's see. Ooh, there's too many there right now. What the hell happened to him? Wow, okay, he just got blown to shit. I have no idea why. I missed it. <laughs> he just went squish out of nowhere. More napalm. Right there. Hopefully the crate hits quickly. It'll hit that guy in the head. No, stay there. No, stay, no, stay there. Oh. Oh, well, I'll have to settle for killing those two. Boom. Somehow I missed him. I don't even know how. I don't even know how that's possible. Let's use our thumper. <laughs> oh! No! Oh, the, the thumper blew us up, too. Oh, I forgot to get the gun with that guy. Oops. I forgot to get the gun with my zombies, too. No! They lost their gun. Oh, they picked it up automatically. Okay, good. Good, good. I forgot to get the gun with this guy, though, so he's just useless. <laughs> I don't know what happened to his gun. It rolled over there at the, at the start, and now it's just gone. I might try and get him up here, through here, and get a gun at some point. Maybe. Oh, you bastards. Okay, let's see. I need to remake my guy again, sadly. Uh, we'll use someone cheaper this time. We'll use Gordon. Good old Gordy. Uh, you need a digger, and you need a thumper. Thumper. No. Yes. Oh, no, you don't. They're still here. Okay. Do that again. Get rid of the guns. Just give me a Gordon. Actually, give me two Gordons. Twice the Gordon, twice the fun. Uh, they're still more or less stuck right here. They're not going anywhere. And this is just the first layer of defense for my base. These these little light MG turrets, they're the first layer of defense. I have all this other stuff <laughs> before they get to my brain. So you can probably see how good... What are you doing? Gordon, you fail! Oh my god. Gordon thought he was Rambo and ran out and tried to kill them on his own. He got owned. Pick up the digger. Get away from the edge. Ugh. Gordon. What am I going to do with you? Anyways, yeah, that little bottleneck, that's just a first layer of defense. They're not even into my base yet. <laughs> they haven't done anything yet. Give me a thumper. Because the first Gordon decided to be a dumbass and run out and blow himself up like an idiot. No idea why. Thumper. Give me the thumper. There we go. Okay. We need to go over here. We'll try and shoot this guy on the way out. Oh, missed. Missed horribly and knocked my own gun on the way out. And died horribly. <laughs> the enemies in this game are really good at aiming, sadly. So... That's going to happen quite a bit. Let's go ahead and get a brown coat. They're a little bit tougher. Hopefully he won't die as fast. Not that him dying wasn't my fault. The way the thumper works is it, it hits, explodes, and shoots out shrapnel. And almost always that shrapnel will bounce back and hit me in the face. It pretty much never fails. So, as good as the thumper is, it's a pain in the ass to use. Switch to the digger. Whoa, okay. I don't know. Someone just shot a grenade at me or something. There we go. Get over here. And kill this asshole, please. If memory serves, they cannot shoot straight up. So I should be able to shoot straight down and kill him, in theory. Oh, he walked away. <laughs> okay, let's just get down there. Shoot! <laughs> I just killed myself. Yep. Brilliant. Uh, well, that shows you how tough the fucking turrets are. That that turret right there that's running around in my little gold mine is the exact same as these turrets right here. They are extremely tough. Let's see what you guys are doing. This guy's still stuck in the wall trying to get past this one barricade. 
and failing. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I don't want a thumper. I want something else. Let's see. I can get a concrete gun and go down there and fill this up behind the Mia. That would work. Hmm. Let's try the RPG this time. Yeah. Oh, I'm out of money. I gotta dig. Gotta dig some more. Did she drop her digger? Why did she drop her digger? Pick it up. Ugh. What are you doing, lady? I need that. That's how I get the monies. Eh, digging away. Trying to get some money. Not having a good time of it. That guy over there is actually digging through my tunnel. You can see him on the left over there. They do come with diggers, but it's not very often. And usually what they do is they'll sit in that little top hole right there and just dig around like a dumbass. <laughs> they never actually go down and try to get to my diggers. So... Oh yeah, and the, the first time I did this, I dug the hole straight down. I dug a big hole all the way down to the base straight down, but if you do that, they'll fall down to your base down there, the roof of your base, and they will dig through. They'll dig through the top of your base. So that's not a good idea. Do not do that. That should be plenty. Bye. Yes. <clears throat> There we go. He's at the digger. I don't want the digger. I missed. Okay, we'll try that again after it reloads. <laughs> he just killed his own guy. Brilliant. And he killed himself. Even better. <laughs> oh, you done good, son. You done good. Looks like the turret's actually stuck on the ground over there. That's good. Make it easier to kill him. And down we go. And... Boom! Load, please. Load, please. Boom! Dead. No more turret. No more turret in my little base down here. Let's see if we can get him out. Probably not. There's too many sticking points on the edges here. But I'm gonna try. No, there's no way I'm gonna get him out. I'll just leave this guy down here as defense in case someone else actually gets down here. We're gonna set you up right. Come on. Right here. On this little bump. And I'm not gonna put him on AI. If I do, he'll just blow himself up. And I don't want him to blow himself up. So, yeah. Oh, I gotta get some napalm out. Let's see, where's my bombs at? Actually, let's try the cluster bomb again for the hell of it. Sometimes the cluster bomb works beautifully. It's supposed to hit the ground, explode, and throw out these little mines that also explode. But usually that's not what it does. Usually it just does nothing. We'll see though. <laughs> the crate itself fell on that guy and killed him, but the mine did nothing. I mean, the, the bomb did nothing. That's why I don't use the cluster bomb. It's a piece of crap, basically. You just need to chill there, chief. Do not shoot anything, please. You will kill yourself. Oh, wow. Okay, I need to dig a bit, and then I need to napalm those guys. Because there's like six of them there. <laughs> ah, just give me some gold so I can blow people up. Actually, hmm, hmm, okay, so I had to stop there for a second because I forgot to time the video like a moron. I do that a lot, it's just the way it works. So I'm back, and I'm digging, and those guys are still killing themselves, I can hear it. Sounds like my MG turret was messing someone's day up, because that's what it does. Shoots people in the ankles. 
blows their feet off, and then shoots them in the head, and blows their head off. <laughs> in that order. That is what it does. And it is very good at it. It should be plenty. Let's see, what do I want to do now? Hmm. I don't want to cluster mine. I probably need to napalm someone. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. I forgot about you guys. ETA 3, 2, 1. Napalm time. Time for the napalm. Boom! Kablam! <laughs> the fallout just all shot up in this guy's face. Oh no, don't go up there. Mr. Guy with no foot. <laughs> don't go up there. Fall back down into the napalm. You know you want to. Oh, it looks like he's gonna make it. He's he's got he's got a stump where his foot used to be. <laughs> and there's a whole bunch of debris of dead guys over here. Oh, get a peacemaker. Interesting. He's still chilling. Uh, let's see. I'll go ahead and dig out a little bit more over here real quick. Oh, there's a revolver cannon down there. Interesting. I doubt I can get to it without a digger, though. The enemies will actually bring you. Sorry about that. I had to turn my volume down. Uh, the enemies will actually bring you really good weapons if you if you keep an eye out for it. Like, see that guy right there? He has the uh, repeater nail gun cannon thing, which is a really good weapon. He'll end up getting himself killed, or I'll kill him, and then the weapon will just be sitting there. I could actually steal weapons that way if I wanted to. If you want to be economical about it. It's not really much point, though. I mean, there's infinite gold, pretty much. Okay, let's see. I gotta get to the destruction. Uh, get rid of that. Bodies. I want Brutus. And I want a flak cannon. And we'll give him a Glock, too, for the hell of it. Just in case they knock the flat cannon out of our hands, we'll have a Glock to fall back on. It actually happens a lot in this game. They'll shoot your weapon, and your weapon will go flying out of your hands, and you'll basically be useless. Let's see. Stop falling. Fly. Fly, Brutus, fly. No. Wow, okay, they knocked the gun out of my hand. They knocked the other gun out of my hand, and they killed me. <laughs> Shit. Ugh. Okay, I'm not going to use Brutus. He doesn't fly very quickly, and he just kind of drops like a rock. We'll use a brown coat. Why not? <laughs> yeah, they, they knocked the flat cannon out of my hand, and then I switched to the Glock, and he knocked the Glock out of my hand. <laughs> Immediately. Before I could even shoot. Okay. Brown coat for the win. Boom. Dead. Boom. <laughs> Not dead. Dead. <laughs> See, this is the flat cannon. This is the power of the flat cannon. Might be the most generically awesome weapon in the entire game, if I'm being honest. Actually, there's a flamer down here. There's the Glock, by the way. Go ahead and reload that. Oh, hell, ooh, rocket. Gotta be careful. Boom! <laughs> See ya! She had a flat cannon too? Or was that my flat cannon? That was probably mine. Where'd the rocket go? The rocket probably fell down there. And if I go down there, I can't get out. That's one of the beauties of that design. That long initial tunnel. You can't get out if you go down there. Reload. I don't want to reload. I want the flamer. Yeah, give me that. Yes! The flamer is probably the best short-ranged weapon in the entire game. It just annihilates people. Let's see who's over here. Hello. Ow! Oh, too short range! Ow! Oh, I couldn't get to him. <laughs> but I did kill two people or something like that, so that's good. Bye. Yeah, we'll just do that again. That's actually one of my favorite generic setups. The, uh, the flat cannon and the, the light brown coat guy. He's like, he's kind of like a mix between 
fairly tough and fairly quick all in one. He can actually take some shots. Boom! <laughs> Two for one deal. Half off you dead guys for the win. I think he has a flamethrower over there. Which means I don't want to get near him. I'm trying to stay over here. Oh! No, don't drop the flat cannon. Pick it back up. There we go. Yes. 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 No. No. Oh, I missed. Okay, reload, please. There we go. If he comes flying up, he is toast. Come on. Come on. Eh, forget it. I'll go get him. Come on. Boom! Oh, he survived. He had a helmet. He was one of the armored soldiers. I took his helmet off. Oops. I missed. But the Glock did the job. Someone shoot me in the back with a shotgun or something. <laughs> you bastard. My back is shredded. You can see, like, blood is squirting out everywhere. Let's see if we can go kill this guy. Where are you? Oh, that had to hurt. Reload. Re reload. <laughs> oh, reload. I should have switched to the Glock. That was my fault. Let's see. That's the flat cannon, though. It's beast. Probably the best gun in the entire game, in my opinion. It's just really, really strong. Let's play around with a sniper rifle for a bit. Why not? I don't need a brown coat, though. And I don't need a Glock. I need... Dimitri. Where are you, Dimitri? Yes, I need you. I choose you, Dimitri. Look at all the, the gore down there. Just the bits of people. <laughs> She's trying to dig through. There we go. Okay, let's snipe some dudes, shall we? Oh. Oh. Stop moving. There we go. Goodbye. Look at his helmet. <laughs> that helmet didn't help you, bro. The helmet got caught on my little barrier down there, my little wall. <laughs> let's see if there's anyone over here that I can shoot, snipe in the face. No? Oh, crap. He's shooting at me. No! He's shooting the beanbag gun at me. Don't do that. If that hits me, I'm fucking dead. If I had full armor on, I might have a chance to live it, maybe. But I don't have any armor. I'm just a human, <laughs> so if that hits me, I'm dead. No, don't shoot me with the Annihilator, please. Don't do that. Whoa, okay, don't do that. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay, you're just gonna chill right here for the moment. Reload first. And just chill. <laughs> they got a beanbag gun on my right and an Annihilator on my left. I choose life. I don't want to get blown to bits. Let's bust out Sandra with her sexiness. It actually says she's sexy in the description. I'm not making that up. We'll give her a revolver cannon. Why not? Oh, I need to get some... I need to get some gold first. Once I get her far enough over here, I'll try and have it auto-dig. If the, the, the tunnel is narrow enough and you start out high up on the gold like I am, I'm standing on top of most of the gold, sometimes they'll do auto-digging fairly well but it's rare we'll see what happens that should be good yeah, that should be good right there okay do the auto digging please I'm surprised Dimitri hadn't done anything retarded yet and got himself killed let's see is there anyone over here mm, no there's some cool weapons over there. There's a flamer over there. But there's no enemies. Let's see, is there anyone over here? Kneel down. Mm, no. Oh, there's some really nice... Oh, crap. Don't hit me with that, please. No, 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 don't go over there. No, no, no. Grenade. Oh, shit. Part of that grenade actually hit me, too. Okay, so I'm gonna napalm this guy, and that'll be the end of this episode. You grenade me. That's fine. I can take it.
I'm a man. But you get a napalm in the face. Yes, yes you do. Actually, you're gonna get a crate in the face, and the crate is gonna kill you. <laughs> before the napalm even can. Mm, incoming! You thought you were going somewhere. Boom! <laughs> Goodbye! Bye bye! Bye bye little whatever your name is, I can't remember at the moment. Blonde chick. Anyways, uh, we'll be back with part three. See you guys next time.